You clear your bottlenecks for the leads, boom, now you're getting dates, okay? You clear your bottlenecks for the dates, now you're getting girls back to the house. Clear your bottlenecks back to the house, now you're getting closes. You clear your bottlenecks on the retention, now you're getting a rotation and a harem and having an abundance of women, which is why we're all fucking here. What's up guys, John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. Today I want to talk about how to clear bottlenecks. Okay, where's your game closing up? Okay, you have a bunch of girls, you have a bunch of opportunities, and then boom, the funnel closes and it doesn't make it through to having sex with the girl. Okay, so I'm going to go over where the game can break down. This is kind of a follow-up video to my video yesterday. Okay, my video yesterday kind of showed my whole macro overview of my game, as you can see here in this chart. And today I want to look at where most of your game is breaking down, okay, in the, in the areas of your funnel, so to speak, and why it's stopping you from getting results, okay? So before we continue, please uh, keep in mind you can book a 30-minute free strategy session, okay, with me personally down in the description, okay? That's me personally, free 30-minute call, okay, where we can diagnose your game. I can show you how I can help you to run your game like a machine like this, okay, so you can start pouring in lots of hot girl results, okay, in the very first week right out of the gate, and I can show you the fastest way to fast track those results to that point, okay, so the link is in the description, free 30-minute call, you can book that, uh, please subscribe if you've not already, new videos every day at 2 p.m. Eastern time, okay, so <clears throat> a lot of guys, okay, aren't even good on the initial approach, right, if you have shitty online game pictures, or you have shitty skills and in-person interactions with night game and day game, okay, you're not gonna even get any phone numbers or what I refer to as leads, okay? So if you're not getting any leads at the top, there's nowhere left to go, okay? Think of this as a funnel, there's nowhere left. The funnel is closed, okay? You don't even get to play the rest of the game. You don't even get to move down to these other parts. So of primary importance is fixing these three things at the top, okay? If you have shitty pictures, you need to replace your pictures. You need to have them enhanced aesthetically, okay? not going into the details of how to do all that, but that's what you need to do. Then you need to learn how to properly run a night game interaction at bars and clubs, okay? Those of you that enjoy RSD content, I'm speaking to guys now on a regular basis that have taken three, four, five, even 12 RSD boot camps, have no idea how to run a night game interaction, okay? Good job, RSD, two thumbs up. You guys fucking suck, okay? You're always like, why do you hate on them? Because they're fucking wasting your time, okay? Then in day game, you need to know how to properly run a day game interaction. And no, the answer is not just taking tons of action. Okay, I'm speaking to guys on the phone. Oh yeah, I've been, I've been putting lots of action in for years. Okay, so, I, so it's, the results are gonna come eventually. No, they're not. Okay, you're, you're banging your head against the wall. You're doing it wrong. Okay, if you're not getting results from your game, then you're doing it wrong. I, I ran into a guy in Las Vegas in 2013 that was in Todd's immersion program. He's like, I've been in Todd's immersion thing for 10 months. I said, okay, how many times have you gotten laid? Okay, he said zero. This guy was better looking than me. He was able to have a conversation just fine. He said zero, but Todd says my game is getting a lot better. Todd says my game is really progressing. Okay, I spoke to a guy yesterday. He took in a Tyler bootcamp, RSC Tyler, in December and in February. Okay, he got nowhere from it, barely learned anything. And he said, uh, Tyler says that I just need to take four boot camps, and that's where things will really start to click. And they're even selling these stupid boot camps that they put out, which are basically worthless, okay, in packs of four now, okay, it's no longer just enough to get ripped off one time by RSD, they want you to buy a pack of four, okay, so you can get a little bit of a discount and really fucking hate your life after, after these four giant wastes of time, okay, with a huge beta loser named fucking RSD Tyler. Once you get those things handled properly at the top, okay, and if you want to learn how to do that, you can get a call on a call with me, link in the description, then you're going to have a whole bunch of leads, okay, now, the next big piece that comes into play is your texting. So look in this chart here, moving down to lead management. That is all your text game and your text messaging. Now, that includes your messages from online game, okay, but also how you do your texting so you can set up dates, okay? So the ability of your text game directly translates into how many dates you have. If your text game sucks, which most guys do, boom, your funnel closes, okay? There's your bottleneck, okay? So as we, to recap, as we've seen, if you're not doing online night game and day game properly, you have a bottleneck right at the top of the funnel, you're not putting leads into the funnel, game over right there, okay? Once you're clearing that bottleneck and you're running those properly, now you have leads that can be done, okay, that can be used for texting, text messaging, 
and that can get you dates, okay? Most guys, text game is extremely shitty, okay? Almost everyone's. And it doesn't need to be. I've defined it all for you, okay? I have over 12,400 leads at the time of making this video. I tell guys exactly how to text in a flowchart fashion. They copy and paste all the guesswork is removed. I tell them what to do in every situation. There's only a certain number of things that can happen when you're trying to set up a date. I tell them what to do in every one of those situations. For instance, if she gives you an objection, which can be of any of these types over here, safety objection, logistics, location, comfort, sex hookup, dealing with non-responses, etc. I tell you how to deal with those and get your dates set up. Okay, so look, now you've cleared that bottleneck. Now you're getting leads and now you're getting dates instead of the funnel closing or being very narrow. Okay, now what do you do? You either set those dates straight to the house or you set them in public and then you need to get the girl back to your house if it's in public. Okay, so you need to know how to run your dates either if they're straight to the house or how to run them in public and bring them back to the house. Okay, that's another bottleneck. Once guys start getting phone numbers and then they start getting some dates, then they have no idea how to get the girl back to the house or they're running their dates wrong or they're not being sexual on their dates. They're not seeking to pull back to the house on their dates so they're not having the opportunity to close or they get back. We'll go over that in a second. Okay, so let's, let's say that, okay, you're not running your date properly. No girl is gonna wanna come back with you. Okay, you're not running your public date properly. You're not setting the date straight to the house properly. No girl is gonna even end up at your house. Okay, your bottleneck is there. Now your funnel is closed there. So even if you get the leads, the lead acquisition handled, and even if you get the texting handled so that you're getting dates, now you're, you can run into the problem where you're not getting any of those dates to wanna to come back to your house, okay? So once you clear that bottleneck, now, okay, now you have girls back at your house and then lots of guys come to me, okay, I, I've learned how to get girls back to my house, but I'm not closing any of them or we're getting into makeouts and she's leaving or like I go to escalate and she's weirded out and she leaves. There's a specific formula, just like every other piece of this about how to run the dates or how to run back at the house once the girl either comes there directly or comes there from public date. If you don't know what to do, which most guys don't, then you will fuck it up and you will not have sex, which is this box here, okay? So it should be clear to you now, either you're not acquiring leads properly, you're not setting dates properly because your text game sucks, and the reason why, okay, backing up, you're not acquiring leads properly because your online game, night game, and day game suck, you're not getting dates because your text game sucks. You're not bringing dates back to the house because your date game sucks. You're not closing at the house because you don't know what the fuck to do at the house and that part is off. And then, last but not least, once you have accomplished all those things and you know how to get the leads, how to set up the dates with text message, how to run the dates, get them back to the house, how to close, now you're having sex regularly. But, and this is another major problem and another major bottleneck, lots of the girls are dropping off, if not all of them. Okay, so I, I help clients with this part all the time. How do you retain the girls? Because what good is putting in all this work beforehand and doing all this game, and now you had a one night stand and the girl's gone, okay? Especially if she was hot or the sex is really good and she's gone, nothing is more frustrating, okay? I've talked to tons of guys that've had this problem. I used to have this problem as well. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I don't know if you guys can hear the, the intensity of this wind. It's like a fucking tornado is about to happen. Um, okay, and then you retain them and now you have options for a girlfriend, you have a rotation, you have a harem, and very, very, very few guys make it to that point. Very few, okay? All my clients get to that point, okay? With very few exceptions, okay? Unless they're like an ultra hard case newbie that can, you know, that literally cannot even approach someone because they're trembling and shaking and sweating. That's, those are extreme cases. But even most dating coaches, I won't name any names, but a lot of the very popular dating coaches out there said they've never had more than two or three regulars, okay? Almost all of the popular dating coaches out there have told me that personally, or I know that they've told someone else that, which is disgraceful and ridiculous. Okay, I run 12 to 17. I won't, I won't even go down that road, okay? But, and they're hot too, not, you know, then you have, the, the industry is such a laughing stock to me. It's, you, you have Todd and Julian, all these guys that married average to below average girls, married. Good job. That's what you can, you know, if you follow those guys, that's what you can hope at the ultimate level is to marry a, a below average pig, okay? And, and guys like, you, you're a dick. Like she probably has a perfect personality. Who knows, but even if she did, there's plenty of hot girls that are gonna have as good or, or better of a personality. So that is not a good argument, okay? Um, it's, it's like you go to a make money online conference or make money conference. You have a guy that gets up there and says, here, look, here's my bank account. There's $6 in it. And now I'm gonna tell you guys all how you can make shitloads of money, okay? And by the way, buy all my products, take my live training, and watch all my YouTube videos, okay? But 
at my level, you're going to have $6 in your bank account. Okay. Maybe you'll get there one day. That's, that's basically the pickup community. That's 99% of the coaches in this industry. Okay. That's really nice. And I talk to guys every day. Oh man, I saved up for two years for, for Derek's program. And he sat like a fat slob on the couch and didn't help me with one interaction. Then he divided the room into two groups and he said all those people that didn't want to pay a whole bunch more to take more training that they're all fucking losers and berated them and use high pressure sales tactics and threaten them and all this stuff. That's what guys are paying money for in this industry, okay? Because they're being massively diluted. This, what you see on the screen, this is real game. This is taught to you by a guy that fucked over 1,250 girls for real, okay? That takes this game very seriously, that highly optimizes this game. And I'm plugging guys in on the steep part of the graph. I'm plugging them in. You don't have to go through the exponential progression that I did. You're getting plugged in right at the steep part of the graph, okay? So very often now in, the, in the, the recent months, when a guy comes on my training, within a month, he's overloaded with too many girls. He has too many girls than he can handle, okay? Which is a great problem to have. And the problem that you should have, okay? Not the other problem where I can't even get one fat girl in my life, okay? Which is what, what most of the guys watching, or, or one average girl, which is mo what most guys are, are encountering, okay? The, they don't have options for sex. They don't have a rotation. They're mass approaching at malls and streets, okay? Acting like clowns, being taught by RSD and other retard companies to act gamey and fancy and stupid, okay? And the girls are like, you're a gamey, fancy, stupid fucking idiot. And I'm never going to sleep with you, right? And the guys are like, well, maybe I should just do these retarded tactics for three more years, okay? Or maybe I should buy a pack of four boot camps from, a, from one of the biggest beta losers in the entire industry, okay, RST Tyler. And he's going to solve the problem, okay? What's going to happen after that four boot camps? They're going to tell you to buy another four. And believe me, I talked to the guy that took 12 RST boot camps, okay? He's in his 40s, and he told me that he had no idea how to run a night game interaction, okay? 12 boot camps, okay? Lots of people are waking up now to what a fucking pile of shit that company is. But some have not seen the light yet, okay? Here's real game, okay, for the last time. You clear your bottlenecks for the leads, boom, now you're getting dates, okay? You clear your bottlenecks for the dates, now you're getting girls back to the house. Clear your bottlenecks back at the house, now you're getting closes. You clear your bottlenecks on the retention, now you're getting a rotation in the harem and having an abundance of women, which is why we're all fucking here, okay? We're not here to do 10 months. That guy that, that took the Todd immersion for 10 months, he said he was going out almost every night, okay? Zero girls, zero. Todd's telling him, your game's improving. You're getting way better. No, you're fucking not getting way better, okay? In what skill game, when you're not getting any results, are you getting way better? Zero. Okay, it's, it's pseudoscience BS. It's just, it's just to encourage you to, to continue with training. And, and a lot of these guys speak to on the phone. Oh, well, Todd or Derek or Tyler tells me I just need more training and then we'll solve it. No, it never ends. They want you to keep buying more training so that they keep getting paid and you're never going to get good with those companies. Never. Okay. And it, it's so far, <laughs> it's so far out of control. Okay. I've never had people take multiple programs, okay? I solved the problem, okay? This is what should be happening in the industry. Not selling four packs of live, pro live programs with some fucking slob beta piece of shit, okay? <clears throat> That's lying his ass off and, and it goes on and on and on and on, okay? And they, they promise you the world, okay? But look, they, they're marrying or have girlfriends with average to below average chicks, okay? I have my whole rotations are stacked up with super hot chicks. If I drop out for a girlfriend, it's like a 9 to a 9.5 plus, okay? Because there's no reason to have a, a, a girlfriend that's below that if your game is solid, okay? They don't, they don't have any game. They don't have any ability to teach, okay? And they're just fucking using high-pressure sales tactics <clears throat> and other empty promises to get you to buy a million programs, okay? Rant over. Here's the game. If you're ready to clear your bottlenecks and solve this in a matter of, shoot, uh, <laughs> in the matter of a few short weeks, okay? or a month to two max to have a very advanced skill level at this. Book a free call, 30 minutes, in the description. I'll go over the game plan with you, uh, and that's it. Hope you enjoyed this presentation. Uh, subscribe if you're not already. I'm John Anthony, the only man with the fucking results, okay? And I put my money where my mouth is here. This is the system, okay? Nobody else talks about this. They're talking about Get into state and be free from outcome and clear an intent and all that stuff. And then when you get into the interaction, you're like, what the fuck does that mean? Okay, not very much. Surprise, surprise. Okay. But it sounds nice, doesn't it? Not, not really. All right. Thank you very much for watching. See you guys in the next video. Take care. So
do it for the income But we do it for the outcome Some of us are active while others just let their mouth run No doubt son, this is not just about fun We will not be outdone by these cowards who shout scum